this is what you can expect on this week's vlog. Police, get behind me, baby. I'm going to pull up at the stoplight. Hey! Hello? I would say what lace, but you probably can still see my lace. First, my shoulders start tingling. Now, now it's in my chest. It's not that I don't want you here. It's something about the way you stay. welcome back to another weekly vlog my name is Shay welcome to life of Shay where I take y'all on the day-to-day -day of my life dang I don't know if I did that right I gotta go back and rewatch my other vlog because when I originally said it it kind of flowed but then just then it didn't flow like it did on the other vlog so I gotta memorize that because I liked it so listen 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 here Listen, Linda, this week I have dropped the ball. I just haven't been feeling like vlogging this week. And I had like a lot of stuff that I could have vlogged, a lot of good content, but for whatever reason, I just haven't been feeling it. And I'm here today to kind of pick myself up. Y'all saw yesterday, um, y'all kind of saw me cleaning. Yesterday was uh, Monday. Y'all kind of saw me cleaning because that's what I do usually when I get off work. Go to work, come home, cook, clean, da 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 But yesterday my husband cooked. So all I needed to do was just kind of clean my kitchen and stuff. So that's what y'all saw. Um, I don't even think I came on camera. Oh, I took my hair down. Yeah, it was time for them braids to go. They were, they were up way longer than they needed to be. Child, I looked a mess, okay? It is what it is. But anywho, I am, today's Tuesday, today's Tuesday what? What is today's date? The 8th? November 8th. And I decided, like, since I haven't been vlogging this week, i just been, like, actually thinking about my channel and just thinking about, like, where I want to be with this channel and all that. And I realized I have really been bullshitting when it comes to my channel. Like, I be half-stepping, and that's just not it. That's just... I, nobody to blame but myself and what I mean by that is child these are weekly vlogs that means I should be vlogging every single day of the week but the reality of it and I'm calling myself out the reality of the situation is I don't vlog every single day because honestly I have a nine to five baby a girl has a nine to five so during the week I don't do much of nothing literally I do much of nothing come home cook clean 
go to bed. Come on, cook, clean, go to bed, go to bed, go to bed. Like, I do nothing during the week. So, I really don't vlog during the week. I, I usually just vlog on the weekend and then call it a weekend vlog. And I'm like, yeah, that's half-stepping. I need not to call it a, a weekly vlog if, it, if I'm really just filming on the weekend. My battery going dead, so let me fix that and then I'll be back. Okay, and just like that, we back. We back in this thing, period. So, what did I leave off at? I think I was calling myself out, basically saying that I be half-stepping and I don't be giving y'all what I need to give y'all. So, um, yeah, we're gonna, I'm gonna, I've been like kind of brainstorming how I want my channel to be, you know, think areas that I can improve. And it may not be this video. We may not see improvement on this particular vlog because shoot today is tuesday and i really i usually put my vlogs out on thursday so y'all may get like a three day vlog maybe a two and a half day vlog but moving forward i am going to vlog daily and get and actually put the time stamps in the videos because i just feel like why not you know even if i'm not doing anything i'm sure there's other people that ain't doing nothing on their day to day and they vlog it but anywho i'm not gonna bore y'all with that let, let 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 let's talk about me being a gangster let's talk about that like right now i'm out in these streets thugging okay i'm thugging i don't even know if i'm saying it right do i sound hard thugging i'm out here thugging anywho so let's talk about it guys so my um what is this called the sticker on your window my tags went out at the end of september November 8th my, my tags still say September of um, 2022 yeah so I've been out here thugging hiding from the popos when one get behind me I have a mini heart attack cuz ah, don't pull me over cuz I'm scared one and two I'm gonna bust out crying because I don't want you to give me a ticket so I feel like if I start crying you may not give me a ticket you may you may not i don't know but thankfully the good lord has been on my side and the police has not pulled me over not once and um i am headed to go get my tag because y'all know my car my car was you know down and out let me tell y'all let's talk about my car let's talk about this ghetto this i ain't never in my life had to do no mess like this before but it's being done now so my check engine light came on and the the I thought it was a valve, something wrong with the valve. I don't know nothing about cars. But like a little rubber piece inside the car somewhere up there broke. So I just need another little rubber piece put on my car. But my car drives fine, you know, it seems fine. But the check engine light is on. And y'all know y'all can't get no inspection with the check engine light. And I have a Jag. I have a Jag. And honestly i have not called the i haven't i haven't called jaguar to see how much it will cost to get my car fixed but what i do know a diagnostics or whatever where they diagnose the car or whatever i do know that that's damn near 300 dollars. so if that's 300 dollars, could you imagine how much a little rubber piece is going to cost to put on this car yeah i don't got time for that it's, it's not in my budget and i don't want to do it it's just no because then nobody tell this car to break down who told you to break down, baby? Who told you to do that? Why is rubber breaking any damn way? I don't understand. Anywho, that's neither here nor there. So, you know, I had to do a little research, a little hood research, and, you know, find out, you know, who can do inspections with a check engine light on and pass them. Now, I'm not saying I did that, but I had to do some research. Anywho. I am headed to go get my tags and baby I am so excited because what police get behind me baby I'm gonna pull up at the stoplight hey hey mr. officer yes yes cuz get behind me baby I'm good tags gonna say September 2023 instead of September 2022 play with your mama don't play with me Thinking I can date a cop. Here we go, here we go. Wee, wee, wee. And all I want me to do is put the police. Help, get my tag. I'm getting my tag. Oh, oh, can't see them. Oh, that's the police, y'all, the police. Woo! Woo, that's the police, y'all. I ain't got my tag, Lord. I ain't got my tag. 
Ooh, 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 baby, I'm not ready to say we we yet. Woo, baby, talk about a mini fucking heart attack. This is what I'm talking about. I'm tired of this. I'm tired of this. Now I got to get behind him, and that automatically let him know that okay, why she get behind me? Cause she could go straight. It's it's room for me to go straight, but no, I get behind him so he know. He know I'm up to something. Oh, cause sir, don't don't step on your brakes. I thought there was some lights. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I got too crunk listening to Mr. Officer. Y'all, I'll be back. I'll be back after I get my tags. Cause what? <sighs> mm -mm. Y'all quit playing with me. I got my freaking tag. Oh my. Woo, baby. I was tired of being a gangster. I was tired. I was tired of running from the police. I don't have to have no more mini heart attacks like I did last clip. I ain't have none of that. Now I'm gonna go find a cop and go ask him how his day doing. What? gonna pick my baby up then we're gonna go home i pray to god my husband cooked because i don't think he's on the road today so yeah i pray to god he cooked if he didn't cook don't know to tell everybody and then we're gonna get into me trying to install a wig on his head because i gotta get good at y'all i gotta get good I'm, I, I, uh, last time i installed a wig ah, baby it was it was a mess so i started right here First off, don't judge me. I'm the baby hairs. I thought I was doing something, okay? I thought I was doing something, but now I think I may be better. I think I might be able to, to finesse this today. I'm not sure, but I was wrong for them baby hairs. So, yeah, we're we going to see what it do. We're going to do what it do. We're going to see what it do. But I'm legal. Wee, 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 wee. Baby, I walked through the door and they're having a whole family meal and didn't think to wait on me to come home to eat. Babe, what do you have to say for yourself? Your plate is sitting right there. Guess what I got you. That's all you have to say? What you make, baked chicken? Lemon pepper chicken. Yay. I don't know how to feel about this. I can't believe I didn't wait on the pill. Okay, y'all. So now it's time for me to install this wig that I don't really know what I'm doing, but it's okay. We're going to act like we know what we're doing. So I bought a few items. Actually, I bought these a long time ago because I be playing in my little wig even though I don't do good. So I bought this Gosta B glue spray because this is what the girls be using when they put their wigs on. Then I bought the gel too, because I wanna say Platinum did use this, or maybe she just used the spray. I don't remember, but I got that. Then I got this Cura Care Wax Sticks because I seen somebody use this whenever they applied their wig. I got a wig cap. I got, I got this, um, Annie's what is this called a hot comb now I know now they make hot combs that kind of have like a dial that kind of you can gauge the temperature this one only has an on and off button so hopefully I don't burn a hole in this wig then I got my little flat irons this is by Remington because my exp expensive ones I dropped on the ground and they broke and I'm pissed about it because I paid like over $100 for those. So I'm not ever doing that again. At least not no, no time soon. So I got the little $18, $25 ones. I don't know if it's between $18 and $25. So this is the wig that I've been having. Real quick. With one of them when I was little, I, I burned my hair off. Why was you messing with it? Because I was hot combing my shit and had long hair. That was like 11, 12. It was the plug in kind or the kind nah, of it was the one stove. you had to put on the stove. And Granny had told me, you know, 
the temperature and everything and put it on, but I was shit, I was in a hurry. I was trying to get shit done. I wanted my shit super straight. I don't know what I was trying to do, but I, I cooked that bitch on high, both sides. And I came and I lifted my shit up. It was about this high. And I just, get, just, just wait, because the vlog needs to see this. Okay. I came, I, 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 I cooked that bitch on high, both sides. And I came and I lifted my hair up. And then I put it on there and I was going to go up. And that bitch just right through. Did you cut your hair off after that? I had to. Is that why I you was, cut your hair? I was sick. No, no, I cut my hair for uh, basketball. All right, y'all. Anyway. So this is the wig that we are playing with today. I honestly, I don't know the length. We're just gonna say 24 length, 24 inches. Um, don't know the texture to even tell y'all. I just know like, it's not silky straight. It kind of got a little roughness to it. So I put a little oil in it to hopefully make it a little better. I don't know if I was supposed to do that, but I did. Mean, but anywho, this is the wig. It was like a, like a like a dark brown but then i didn't like the brown i really wanted it black but i didn't have no black dye so i had a burgundy so i dyed it like burgundy but you can't really tell now when i originally got this wig in style it was really really cute but when i washed the hair after getting it installed like after wearing it for a while i washed it child i couldn't get the wig to look cute again like how the stylist did so this has just been my play wig but i noticed after watching a couple of youtube videos i noticed that the part the parting is like orange so like not the parting i mean the parting is supposed to be orange because that's called bleaching the knots but the hair like the bleach seeped into the hair and now like the roots is kind of blonde and for the longest, I couldn't figure out why it was like that. Like, it, it whenever the roots was kind of bleached, it kind of make it seem like you got a, 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 what is it called? An invisible part. Like, I don't know. It's ugly. So I'm hoping that I can, like, put some brown. I don't know. We're going to play with it because that's just what we're going to do. But anywho, I went ahead and I washed my hair and I braided my hair down. So this is what it looks like. My parts may not be straight, that's okay. Long as it's, you know, my braids are, are flat. That's all I really care about, okay? So this wig, it has no combs in it because I don't like combs, but honestly, I probably really need one in the back because this wig keeps sliding. But it does have an elastic band, so I'm just gonna go ahead and pop it on my head. I'm gonna wear it as, what? Hold <laughs> on, let's try it again. I'm gonna pop this on my head. All right, so I can tell now that the wig is too far down. What? So a good spot for it would be like right before my hairline because that's what the girls be seeing. And yeah, it don't look, I mean, it don't look professional, but half bad so one of the mistakes that i was making um, with this wig is these baby hairs let me show y'all and don't judge me judge your mom so right here hold on where is it oh well here go here goes something right here i was literally doing this I was doing that and I thought that was okay, but that's not okay. Uh, uh that's not okay. That's not, these are too long. These are not baby hairs. These are adult hairs. And then another thing, they're like, I don't like that look. That's ugly. So what I want to do is brush these up and then start over on the baby hairs. So this kind of got glue in it because I didn't wash this wig from the last time I played in it. Whew. So, I'm scared I was gonna burn the hair. So I'm just gonna kinda like flip you, flip you up. Ooh, that burned me, that burned me. Instead of my baby, baby hair starting right here and going whoop, I want them kinda like off to the side. 
Cause I teach this how the girls be doing. All right, so I want my baby, baby hairs to start like right here. So, right there. That's, that's, that's what I want the baby hair to be. Oh, y'all know one thing I don't have? I don't have a, um, what is that thing? Melt the lace band? I don't have a, a, a band. Alright. Now that I got those little pieces out, I'm gonna go ahead and clip them. Okay, look at me acting like I know what I'm doing. Sometimes I see some of the girls pulling it. But I ain't gonna do that. I'm just gonna cut it. Okay, y'all. This is it. This is this is the final look. I'm content with it. I know I probably can do better in some areas, but baby, this looks good. This is it. Hello. I would say what lace, but you probably can still see my lace. But I don't care because I don't look like Wanda off a holiday heart, and that's all that matters. So, y'all. Sorry. Anywho, I'm excited. So now I'm about to start going on Amazon, buy me some little cheap wigs so I can continue to practice, practice different looks, get better, and then I'm gonna go buy the expensive wigs. But y'all, I'm happy with it. Just wait till I put some little makeup on. Mm, give me a cute little thumbnail. Baby, I ain't gotta worry about looking like a chicken head no more. Cause I can put wigs on. I'm one of the girls. I'm one of the wig girls. See, that right there makes me want to twerk. And I don't even know how to twerk. But it makes me want to twerk. Okay? And I put, oh, let me show you what I put in my hair. So, I use this generic value product. It's called Silk. Remedy and I put a little bit a little bit a little bit of this on my hand like literally Less than a dime size. I put it on my hands kind of rubbed it through and then I just kind of like Brushed it on my hair and like I don't know I'm not sure if I said it in the video if I was recording or not But like this hair was kind of rough. It wasn't like silky, but now it's kind of silky It got bounce it don't look dry, baby. Look like I got some moisture in it, and it's not oily and weighed down. So, yes, like what, baby girl? I can't wait to show, tell everybody I did this. I did it. Good morning, guys. Y'all notice my weed? I still don't look like Wanda off Holiday Heart. I'm excited about this, y'all. This is major. This, do y'all know where the, what this means for me? This means that I probably can apply any wig now, you know? So that's more content for you guys, you know? Period. I'm so excited about this. Anywho, good morning. Today is November 9th. Today is my brother-in-law's birthday. And my brother-in-law passed away earlier 
well this past summer june 23rd so this is the first birthday that my bro that my brother that my husband um is experiencing without his brother so last night was a little rough he i mean he tried to hide it for the most part but i could tell he was kind of down and out and so yeah so today i kind of put on some clothes to go to work because normally i don't but um today we plan to go to um is it red not red lobster uh papados or razus papados or razus it's one of those one of those is his favorite restaurant and you, he used to always go there and order lop was it red toes i don't know he used to order some stuff because i don't i don't eat all that i just like fish shrimp and fries but he will order all that crazy stuff and a swamp thing a swamp drink or something like that so that's what we're doing today in remembrance of him um i have to go to work today i'm sad because i would much rather be at home with my husband you know why he's grieving but unfortunately gotta make this bag so i'm headed to work you ready for school pretty girl Yes, but you make me drop my tablet. How did I make you drop your tablet? Um, per stairs. When I stepped on the brakes? No. Oh, I don't know what you're talking about, but come tell the vlog good morning. Oh, you don't want to talk to my friends? Well, let me get you off camera. Why are you being so mean? What? Okay, come on. Let me get you on in this daycare because you, you, you done tripped out today. I don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Because the love you give, you can't be replaced. So no one else can make you do. That's why I don't mind. I'm not in my life with you. Okay, y'all, change of plans. So my husband said he's not gonna be able to make it to the cemetery by the time I go to lunch, which is now. And um, yeah, but we're still going out to eat when I get off work. So, so far that hasn't changed. So being that I kind of prepared myself earlier on my break for lunch, I'm not hungry. So I'm gonna go down the street to where I do makeup at and I'm gonna go ahead and put on a full face because yeah I just need to so I can at least have a cute thumbnail picture for this vlog so I guess y'all gonna get like a little quick little makeup tutorial or whatever and um yeah it's gonna have to be really really fast so that's what that's where we are headed to now since I don't have to meet him for my lunch. makeup hopefully y'all saw that in the previous clip if not then that mean the lighting was just too bad and y'all couldn't see what I was doing anyway but I'm hoping and praying in the previous clip y'all saw me kind of doing my makeup but yeah I didn't put no lashes on because baby I'm supposed to be back at work at 2 47 it is currently 2 48 which means I'm late thankfully thankfully my job is like right down the street but still they're gonna be like baby girl you left looking one way and you come back another <laughs> indeed also y'all my wig it came up like literally hopefully y'all can see it in the previous clip the whole damn wig slid back so i kind of like put it back and sprayed some setting spray on it and i'm hoping that the glue like reactivates and it sticks 
but yeah I don't know but yeah I think I look good and do so I am ready for dinner tonight hopefully my husband don't cancel that because if he do I'm just gonna be like dude I was late for work for nothing okay yeah we have made it to Razoo's um I, I guess I didn't know that uh, my husband had like invited other people I don't know why I didn't think of that um but he set the time for 6 30 so it's currently 6 04 so Mama, we're just sitting and waiting okay we're about to get uh, we're about to get out so we're just sitting and waiting for um 6 30 to come um allowing time for other people to show up so we can have a remembrance a remembrance is that a word so we can have a whatever a remembrance if it ain't a word it's gonna be a word today okay a remembrance dinner for my brother-in-law i hate i just never picked up the camera and vlogged with him but baby he was a character if you know you know and yeah i, I miss dude i really do can't believe can't believe he checked out on us like that but it wasn't up to him. It was the good Lord's timing and yeah. But I picked my baby up from daycare. Sha, mm -hmm. tell the vlog, spell your name for the vlog. How do you spell your name? S. Uh-huh. H. Uh-huh. A. Uh-huh. I. Good job, my pretty girl. You're so smart. I, yeah. Yes, girl, yes. Beauty and brains, that's what I'm talking about. I'm so proud of my little baby. So now, now that she knows how to spell her name, I need to work with her on writing her name. She's just three, y'all. She's in preschool, so she hasn't even started school yet. And my baby is so smart. So, yeah, that's my husband over there. He's in the mozzie. And... I guess I guess he probably finna try to come over here, but I was finna go over there to him. Yeah, cause my car dirty and I don't I don't feel like talking about my car. So yeah, let's get over there. Thank you. Okay, thank you. And um, hot I mean, yes, please. I like to go green tea shop and it's bothering me real bad. First my shoulders start tingling, now now it's in my chest. And I try to drink some tea to kind of catch the burn, but it ain't working. I done drunk babe water, but he got lemon. Who put lemon in that water? Who came up with that? That's just nasty. Now I'm nervous, Lord. I need my water a little next time. That's nasty. I just need something. I need an ice cube. I need to swallow a whole ice cube so it can kind of catch it. She had like a, a, a ice tea shot or something. It was a green tea shot, and I've had green tea shots before, and they're actually good, but baby, that shot had some, 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 some kick to it. Yes, baby.